Hello all, Jeff here with a new video back on Project Cars 2. Instead of doing an, a comparison between all the LMP1 cars at Le Mans, I thought I would do something different. Let's have a full field of 32 LMP1 prototypes at Vintage Le Mans. I'm going to use the Audi R18 since I struggled with the Toyota in a straight line in my um, Spa race. So, this could be interesting. Looking forward to see what happens. So, 32 Le Mans prototypes at Le Mans. Let's see what happens here. So, these guys, I'm just going to get this is on the Porsche Cane. You know, try and stay away from them. Get on my hybrid now. Try and get by as many of these guys as I possibly can without using too much hybrid because we're going to need it for the Mall Sound Straight for oh, Porsche Toyotas all over the shop. I'm just going to get by them so easy. Now, braking, they break so early, it's ridiculous. I did a few hot laps before this. Toyota, what are you doing? You're meant to be the best car. Come on. So, Tet Rouge, very, very different. I'm going to go around the outside of the Toyota. Nicely done. So, let's get in the other Toyota slipstream and see what I can do. Up to 27th now, I'm going to go down to 28th because the Toyota is no doubt on his hybrid. And so are, so are these other Toyotas that are coming as well. I don't know how much hybrid they have, but they've got a lot more than me. Anyway, let's get on mine as well. Let's have a look at the top speed. 360, 370, 373. <laughs> That's getting close to Group C standards. If you didn't have the hybrid, these would be no good. But the thing is, when you run out of hybrid and you're not in the slip train, you just lose all of your speed in these things, which is no good at all. So let's get in this other Toyota slip trim now. Try and catch up. Oh, I don't know why I was rattling so much that wheel. But anyway, we're going to the kink. Are these guys, these guys going to take a flat? Yes, they are. Oh, we're going up. Oh. <laughs> How did I support that? <laughs> wow. Anyway, in the Molson corner. Oh, wow. What is going on here? We've got a traffic jam, ladies and gentlemen. Come on, guys! Look at this! Oh! <laughs> I made a few posies out of that as well. I'll take that any day of the week. So here we go. Now, for the next quarter of the lap, is going to look very, very familiar because not much has changed here. Really, only thing's changed is the fencing and the runoffs. But like the actual corners, like Indianapolis, Arnage. They haven't changed. I'm going to break early because I know this Toyota is going to break early. Oh, Porsche! What a move! Alright, get going. Come on, come on, come on. So, as you can see, there's a few burns at Indianapolis and the same with Arnage. You can't use them because it invalidates your lap, especially in the hot lapping anyway. So, here we go. Get on my hybrid. Use as much of it as I possibly can. So, um, <laughs> yeah, this is awesome. Um, now, this looks familiar, however, after this right hand kick, it's different. Don't use portal to curves here, because instead, we're going to go pretty much flat out to a section called Maison Blanche, the White House. Is he going to break? No. No. These guys don't break either. Now, the Ford Chicane is going to be very, very interesting. It's a chicane of death in many ways back in the day. Oh, come on, guys. You can take that a lot quicker. Uh, I'll, I'll, sh I'll show you what I mean. Right, Make it count. Come on, you can do it. Yeah, I'll give it a crack, mate. But yeah, my plan is, if I don't get in much traffic, I'm going to take that full chicane as quickly as I possibly can. Cause it's like it's like a chicane of death. It's like Dragon Trail Seaside. Like, how ridiculously quick that chicane is. Oh, Porsche with the dive bomb. Oh, I hit the wall. Oh, and I've lost all my hybrid as well, which is no good. This is just a little tear, so I'm going you know. Oh, get a bit slidey! <laughs> oh, wow. But seriously. Oh, this is um, this is amazing. Yeah, I'm around the back of the grid, but to be honest, who cares when you've got such good racing? And look, this is just a little experiment as to seeing what LMP1 cars could do if the mom didn't change it like, what, 40 years, 50 years ago even. So. I'm trying to get in this Toyota slipstream because I've got no hybrid left. So 
as you can see, my, my top speed is slowly reducing. As you can see, if I was on hook 4, I would right in the right behind his slick stream, I'd be doing 370, like I did um, on the first lap. But it looks like there's a, you know, a few guys might slow themselves, slow themselves, da, 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 slow themselves down at the kink. This toy is giving me a bit of a punt. Do you know what I, I, you know, you may as well slow down, mate. Anyway, Molsan corner. Taking it to it so slowly. Shouldn't use that that extra bit of um, road. But anyway, as you can see, things are different. It, it, you know, it doesn't really work, especially at Molson straight with that chicanes. Not with these cars, anyway. Grip C, absolutely it does. But with these things, it doesn't. And I've got a bunch of Toyotas. This Toyota is just going to easily freeze by me. I don't know what kind of setup he's using. Oh, I'll hit the wall. Into Indianapolis. Come on, get going. Why am I in second? <laughs> Into Arnaz. Let's use this um, hybrid. Use as much of it as I possibly can. So I don't want to finish dead last here, and I've lost it. Lost all my hybrid. But it looks like I am catching up to the Toyota. So, you know, happy days from that point of view. We're about to go into Maison Blanche. Not the Porsche curse, because it didn't exist back then. 71 was the last time we had Maison Blanche. Last time before the Porsche curves. And it looks like we'll be able to take the Porsche cane like it's made to be taken. All right, here we go. Let's do this. 200 board. Look at that. <laughs> Let's get 30th. Oh. <laughs> that is old Le Mans. Yeah, I got absolutely flogged, but that's just an experiment to see how these things would work. Keep in mind, that was the hardest difficulty. Normally I do these races at 100 AI. But about 100 is too slow. 130, that's a challenge. Now, keep in mind, I hardly ever play project cars too. So, you know, I might do that a bit more often, just Doing all, doing these little challenges using modern race cars on the, on the old variants of tracks they race on now. But there you go. So if you like the video, smash the thumbs up button. Look, uh, if you end up disliking, it's probably because I finished what 31st out of 32. Anyway, uh, leave a comment. Let me know what you think. Let me know um, what you think of this little experiment. And if you want to see more, subscribe and tap the notification icon. Anyway, this is Jeff here and happy racing. Cheers.